ball whipped in Marcelo from the flank John Arias up front but a lot of experience on Fernando Genesis 11 ball towards this near side Kano a little touch that's not into his desired path Chins on the continent there in terms of football battle on this near flank it looks like there's contact in the box at least that's the way that the you know into the middle just off mm. track for Martinelli trying to bring Arias looking for a few openings tries to mm. cut around the defense not a bad idea but well defended by Boca goal kick for Romero Flamengo who have also had some success here looked like the boot coming out Cavani arguing but Roldan pointing to the national team yet here comes Boca the other way Cavani out wide Marentiel and yet all who have won five Marcelo whips it in glancing header but right back by trade but he is turning into the next superstar for it's that mold but it's his ability what I like about him is his confidence ball into the air groove a little bit more and try to exploit as I said again that high line the plays are kind of take some of the pressure off in terms of the distribution yep and and create things in the middle hasn't quite worked out that way for a few minutes but yeah, one so the winning the ball there briefly now Antini he calls himself almost the anti-pep mm, Pep okay. talking about positioning trying to spread from sideline to sideline get those opportunities and get those two fullbacks going forward that'll be huge nice little back heel kind of coaches trying to figure out anti-position <laughs> <laughs> out a proven goal scorer understands that he needs a done Ooh, Mello beaten by Cavani not on the ball but by speed ball. Xavier fakes Brings it to his left, sweeps it across, Ooh. the ending it off to the young left back, but they anticipate Ooh. well, stripped away by Jean Arias, who gets brought down, and there's a tussle outside the eight. Passions were hot before this game even got underway. Gonzo threading it. Yes. And this is marking as well. Blasted across, smashed against Fluminense in the match in Argentina against River. Laid back, Cavani, Ooh. flag stays down, reaching in to try and touch it. No, Fabro, yeah. you know, he slanted to the right. Well, he started the first 10, 15 minutes. There's almost a cover. You need attention. You need yep. concentration, and that doesn't always last. The header up and over by Nino that just misses the post. Goal kick possession. 10 minutes left to go. Ooh. Regulation. Nice little give and go. Drop to the spot. Oh. Goal! Goal! Fluminense! And it starts with a give and go on the far flank, and a lightning quick attack has given Flu the lead. Absolutely brilliant. This all starts of the second phase attack, and because Fluminense has good numbers in that attack in third, that second ball, they win nine out of ten times, and all of a sudden, Boca is a little vulnerable on that right side. Where? vulnerable position allowing the opposing team to go forward so winning for that opened up the gap the passing nice turn to get away Adia sprints to the goal line or 30 yeah. then he did then he did prior here's Marcelo from distance and clearly being the team now trying to tackle it away happened at that end of this sequence all whipped in but no one And they knocked off some big teams, be it Argentina Juniors, be it obviously equalizer before the break. Fabra, wide, Cavani, back to his half. It's one nothing Fluminense at the break, where he made his name. Just one goal in the Libertadores. So very good uh, Fluminense team. Well, George taking a look at the way Fluminense powered through. Cano flying in. The Andes sweeps it across far side at Vincula. Whips it in with his left foot, clear back in the game. This will be a, a, a tall order for them. Phil, one stat stands. Starting lineup. Marcelo playing some defense, clear to the top. Medina, the shot deflected against them, guys. But in finals, we've seen funnier things or crazier things. But has turned into a Fluminense icon. Ball whipped across. No scramble back here. Kano coming up the right wing, sneaks it across. Because he's defended more than he's been able to attack him. Here's Advincula. Cannon shot, side netting, but on the wrong side of the post. Came close. It can happen. He does try to launch it to the back post, but over everyone, and a wasted effort for Boca. You were throwing your hands in the air there, yeah, Thomas. This is part of what they were doing early on as Advincula launches it inside. Well, ball cleared away, far side. Still field. 
Another player knocked down. Here's Kano threading it forward, but just a little chance into the area. Nino tries to clear. Adias pulled down wide for Kano. Again, flooding the right side. Adias chesting it down. Dribbles into a triple team. Ooh. Seemed to be pulled down in the box. He's up with arms in air. Well, not exactly sure what he was trying to do. Cavani starting a break the other way. Boca psychologically is getting, coming unglued a little bit with the rough tackles and then wants to keep the pressure on almost to a fault. Tonight, it, it might be a crowd trailing, scrambling to try and get back in this. Ball swept across, out. Kind of rest on the result. Ball whipped across. As adventurous as he had been in the past, the Peruvian across the 18, rifle to oh! the back corner, and he's done it again! Wow! He slides through the top of the 18 and slices in his fourth of the tournament. We're tied at one. There will be a lot of discussion why the Fluminense player was not allowed in the field, forcing Oh, flu to drop almost inside their 18-yard box with a number down, obviously, which is normally the case as a team. Round, it's the trophy on the line. Here's Martinelli inside. Shot, Andre. Roldan letting Boca fight to get the ball back. Chance for Fernandez. Cannon shot. This wasn't that fine. Medina overlap. The goal scorer at Vincula. Right-footed crawl. Ball chipped into the 18, but no one making the run. Checking in. So, <laughs> Benedetta pretty much won. Kennedy touching away from the defense. Tries to cut inside the mark. Down into the flex away. Back heel into the area. Cano takes, turns. Kennedy back to goal. Lifted into the area. Settled for Kennedy. The strike oh! to the corner! Oh, what a build-up for Fluminense! And it is John Kennedy with a shot heard around the world. Actually, George, take this one and give me. What do you call this guy right here? <laughs> Come on. Oh, Presidente. <laughs> well, maybe an inaugural moment for the Libertadores champions as he goes into the crowd to celebrate and some of his teammates go with him. Take a look again. This is Fernando Genis overloading. Building opportunity.